We are all aware of the struggle businesses deemed non-essential are going through right now, but we're also hearing concerns over safety for industries allowed to stay open. We're hitting our spring market. Everyone's starting to get busy. Um, we really do want to see those people in these homes. We want to keep the economy going. Danielle DeFelice works at Great East Title Services, headquartered in Bedford, New Hampshire. The company also has offices here, serving southern, eastern, and mid-coast Maine residents. We are still showing up at closing tables, which poses a safety risk. A risk for all those involved in the real estate transaction. We're supposed to social distance and stay far, far away from people to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Is this something that you guys think of every time you maybe sit down at the table? We do. We have taken precautions. We have changed the way we do our closings. But yes, this, this does affect my business. It does affect the way we do business. On March 23rd, New Hampshire Governor Chris Sununu signed an emergency order to allow notaries public to operate remotely during the state of emergency. This is new territory for all of us. State Senator Robert Foley, representing Wells, is trying to get Governor Janet Mills to do the same. It's not just real estate uh, transactions. It's, it's any sort of legal document that needs to be notarized um, that this would impact. Senator Foley was told the offices of the governor and attorney general are working on it. I think it is something that the legislature probably should look at after this is over. But from an emergency standpoint, I think it would be reasonable for the governor to enact this. And I have sent emails all day encouraging um, my local colleagues, the realtors, everyone to go ahead and send that email to the attorney general's office to, to try to help us out with this. We're just trying to keep everyone safe and do our job at the same time. According to the National Notary Association, 14 states have some form of remote notarization. Since the new coronavirus, 12 states have adopted the practice. In New England, it's just New Hampshire and Vermont. And we did reach out to the Attorney General's office this afternoon. We have not yet heard back, but we are aware they are very busy at this time.